Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon. How Kyle Richards' Daughters Really Feel About Cancellation Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star Kyle Richards is weighing in on the news that Netflix has canceled buying Beverly Hills. The streamer axed the show, which starred her estranged husband, Mauricio Umansky, and three of their daughters, after only two seasons. Kyle Richards says her daughters are not very upset about cancellation news. Following fan outcry that Netflix had opted out of renewing the show for a third season, Kyle shared her opinions during a recent Amazon Live appearance. The fans have been very upset about buying Beverly Hills, so many people are like, why? I've seen articles about, why would they do that? So who knows? You never know what will happen with that, Kyle said. The show followed Mauricio's real estate company, The Agency, where his daughters with Richards, Farah Brittany, Alexei Umansky, and Safi Umansky also work. Kyle even appeared during season two to address her marriage troubles with Mauricio. That RHOBA star explained that her daughters care about business, not starring on a reality show. She even claimed that her daughters came to her in tears over the show. They're all businesswomen. They only care about business. She added, they found it very overwhelming to shoot buying Beverly Hills, that came to me in tears so many times. Although her daughters were not very upset about the show not being renewed, they would maybe try reality TV again. They would love it if it happened again, but they are very focused on selling real estate, so I'm proud of them for that, she said. Kyle Richards is at the center of the drama during season 14 of RHOBH. While Kyle's daughters may not care about being reality TV stars, Kyle is one of the most iconic housewives in history. She is returning for the upcoming season along with Garcelle Bovas, Sutton Strack, Erica Jane, and Dorit Kemsley with the addition of Bazoma St. John. In the newest teaser, Kyle finds herself again right in the middle of a disastrous dinner party. The news of buying Beverly Hills getting the axe from Netflix sent ripples through the Bravo universe, but perhaps no one felt the impact more deeply than Kyle Richards' daughters. Far from the public spotlight and Instagram perfect lives, there's a real, raw, and emotional side to how they've been processing the show's sudden cancellation. For Alexa Umansky and Farah Brittany, both of whom played significant roles on the reality series, this wasn't just a career shakeup, it was personal. Alexia, the youngest of Kyle's four daughters, was often portrayed as the eager up-and-comer, trying to carve out her own space in the world of luxury real estate. The series gave her a platform to prove herself outside of her famous mother's shadow. After the cancellation, she felt a mix of disappointment and frustration. For Alexia, buying Beverly Hills wasn't just a show. It was the culmination of years of hard work, ambition, and family legacy. When news first broke that Netflix wouldn't be renewing the show for a second season, Alexia took it hard. She had poured everything into building her real estate career, and the show had become a way to showcase her determination and grit. The cancellation felt like the rug being pulled from under her just when she was starting to find her footing. Privately, she wrestled with the feeling that her hard work might not be enough, that no matter how hard she tried, she would always be Kyle Richards' daughter, before she was ever Alexei Umansky realtor. Kyle, being the protective mom that she is, tried to comfort Alexia, reminding her that there are ups and downs in every career. But Alexia's pride was wounded. She knew the cancellation wasn't a reflection of her talent or potential, but it was still hard to separate the show's fate from her own self-worth. She'd hoped the series would give her a chance to break free from her family's famous name, yet in the aftermath of its end, she couldn't shake the feeling that she was back at square one. Farrah Brittany, Kyle's eldest daughter from her first marriage, had a slightly different perspective on the cancellation. As a seasoned real estate professional and founding member of the agency, Farrah had more experience in the industry than Alexia. For her, buying Beverly Hills was an opportunity to expand the family brand, not just in real estate but in entertainment. However, Farah always approached the show with a measured sense of caution. She knew the volatile nature of reality television, having watched her mother navigate the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills for over a decade. When Farah heard the news, she was disappointed, but not blindsided. She had prepared herself for the possibility that the show might not have a long shelf life. 
Still, that didn't stop her from feeling a pang of regret, not for herself but for her younger sisters. Farah saw the cancellation as a missed opportunity to further establish Alexia and Sophia as real players in the real estate world. The show had been a family affair and its end felt like a chapter closing too soon. Farah, being the pragmatic one, shifted quickly into problem-solving mode. She reassured Alexia that they could build their careers without the cameras, emphasizing that the real work happens behind the scenes, not on Netflix. Farah's own path in real estate had been built slowly and steadily, and she believed Alexia could still achieve greatness, even without the spotlight. But Farah also understood the emotional toll this could take on her younger sister. Alexia had been so hopeful that this show would be her launching pad, and now she felt like she was back to navigating the pressures of being Kyle Richard's daughter without the buffer of her own reality TV fame. Kyle's youngest daughter, Sophia, didn't play a major role in buying Beverly Hills, but she too was affected by the cancellation. Watching her older sisters put themselves out there and then deal with the aftermath made Sophia more hesitant about joining the family business or pursuing a career in front of the cameras. Sophia had always been more private, and seeing the toll the cancellation took on Alexia and Farah reinforced her desire to keep a lower profile. She admired her sisters for their ambition and drive, but she wasn't sure she wanted to follow in their footsteps, especially after seeing the emotional roller coaster that came with the ups and downs of reality TV. As for Kyle, she felt a mix of emotions herself. On one hand, she was disappointed for her daughters. She had hoped the show would be a fun and exciting new chapter for the family, a way for her girls to step into their own while also expanding their real estate empire. But on the other hand, Kyle had been through enough reality TV drama to know that life goes on. She wasn't about to let this cancellation define their future. Still, she couldn't help but feel a bit of guilt. She had encouraged Alexia to pursue the show, believing it would be a great platform for her daughter to shine. Now, she worried that it might have set her back emotionally and professionally. But Kyle's daughters are resilient, a trait they inherited from their mother. As the dust settled on the cancellation, the sisters began to regroup. Alexia threw herself back into her real estate career, determined to prove that she didn't need a reality show to make her mark. Farah continued to mentor Alexia, reminding her that the real estate game is a marathon, not a sprint. Sophia, watching from the sidelines, felt even more grateful for her decision to keep a lower profile but still supported her sisters as they moved forward. For the Richards Umansky family, the cancellation of buying Beverly Hills wasn't the end, it was just a bump in the road. They're used to navigating the ups and downs of life in the public eye, and if anything this setback only strengthened their bond. As they move on from the show, they're more determined than ever to define their own success, on their own terms, with or without the cameras rolling.